Hi everyone, I on the behalf of Extreme Excel Group again welcome you on our YouTube channel. In this video we are bringing a business case. So let's say uh, I own a business and I have multiple uh, extensions, phone extension in our office and people used to make calls to customers and I record their call start time and end time so obviously there are multiple extensions and people are calling in parallel as well so multiple lines are using at a particular instance that is also possible now I do have the logs of all the call start and end times and I can calculate the duration of the call by just subtracting end time and start time but I want to see uh, the call frequency at a particular instance so I want to have a dashboard sort of thing where I can just put the date and time and I uh, see the number of calls being made at that particular instance so for that we have a sort of a dashboard like this where you can choose uh, the date so let's say I want to check the uh, records for 1st April so I just need to select the date from here so we have a button to select the date and once I select the date I can uh, enter the time here right so let's say 7.42 p.m. and I want to see uh, the number of calls being made at, uh, at this particular time let's say 7.42 and I want to uh, I have a slider here where I can actually select the range uh, uh, for which I want to see the records uh, yeah so I have selected the hours and minutes here but I need to select the second from this slider control So let's say uh, I took it to 7.4205 so therefore the start time changed to 7.4205 and if I hit control and then slide it slowly like this then it selects the range and it will give me time from 5 till 40 All right like this I can select the range and once I select the valid range and if there are records present there for the, that particular range uh, then you will see the graphs uh, of the frequency of number of calls being made at that particular instance for, for example like this here at 7.42 and 40th second there were no calls being made right and at the very next moment yes three calls were in progress and then at this instance four calls were in progress so like this we can see the graphical representation of the frequency and we can actually select the time range using a slider control this is it so we have used date control then a slider control and then graphs and a couple of macros to combine all these things and give a particular format of sort of dashboard that's it thanks again for watching this uh, video on our youtube channel keep liking and keep subscribing on our channel thank you see ya bye